income on the second one, the U.S. debt is in like $50 trillion. They're never going to come out of that. So y'all are woke now. Y'all understand that you are Hebrew Israelites and you got to come back. Like they told us the Bible was, you know, it was tampered with. It was the right. And it was. Because uh, the Greeks, when they went down into Egypt, the Ptolemy and them. But we go into the Hebrew. That's the original. Can you get one more scripture before you go to uh, with the Song of Solomon? You can pull it up right quick on your phone. Song of Solomon, Solomon 1 and 5. Song of Solomon 1 and 5. 1 and 5. And it says, I am black. What does it say again? I am black. Why would an uh, 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 Israelite say he's black? Now, there's no need to really say we were black because we already knew we was black. But that was, we keep reading. It says, but calmly, O, o ye daughters of Jerusalem. Comely means beautiful. So he was saying, I'm black and comely, black and beautiful. You ever heard the term, I'm black and I'm proud, right? That's what that's saying. There was nothing wrong with that. But what did they do? They took this image. <laughs> yeah. Do you believe that, sir? Do you believe this is the real Jesus? Do you believe that? That man, that's white devil you see here. That's why we got horns on him. His name was Cedric Borgia, put up in 1456 to be the new Jesus. Pope declared it, Pope Alexander declared himself to be the father, and he said, this is my son. That's why you go in a, in a Catholic church, my father, my yep. father. Yep. And the Bible says, call no man your father. So this was the devil. That's why we got the horns on him, and our people love this. Yeah. The color didn't matter. Why did he put him on? You ever heard of the Renaissance? The Renaissance means rebirth. So when they put, if they put this image up, what was the old image? Yeah, right. Right? right? If they cover, if they redid this image, what was the old image? Let's go to Revelation. One more scripture, please. Revelation. Hey, hey, the, uh, hey, so that's a white man here. He got it here. Revelation one and fourteen. Go one and three You know, ask me. Our heritage was stolen. No, you know, people that are calling themselves Jewish, right? And they're not the real Jews, you know. And they, you all heard of the song Jackson. Where y'all, where y'all from? Indiana. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So the song Jackson, they make it a big deal out of that, you know. But she should have just been quiet the whole time if he not. If you're gonna put out that information, you need to go forward. But they said no. You you doing anti-Semitism, you know? But they putting out this information that they're the real Jews, but you gotta prove that. You know, what we doing is we proving everything through fact that we are the Lord's chosen people. You know, because when we when we wake up and we find we find out that we are and we turn back onto our power, our God, the Lord is gonna deliver us. And he's gonna take down our enemies. This is this is the real battle. Not that BLM, you know, or any of those that you you heard of that NFAC. That's not the we don't need to take up uh weapons to go fight them. Lord said he's gonna fight for us. Because you can't, like, like I mentioned earlier, you can't stop what the Lord set up. Yeah. He well, said the Lord well, put these devils on us for right now. For our, for our punishment again. You know, so you yeah. there's no counsel, as the scripture say, there's no counsel against against the Lord. So you can't take up a gun and bless with the military. Come on, man. Drop bombs and destroy your whole neighborhood. Yeah. 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 Three, one, and three. Five. Revelation. One three. Blessed is he that reads, and they that hear the word of his prophecy. Right, go to verse, verse 11. Just real quick, I know y'all gotta go. <laughs> it's verse 11. It said, I am the Alpha and Omega, the first and the last. Yeah. And what thou seest, write in a book. So this is John the Revelator on the Olive of Patmos. He said, What thou see write in a book. You got a lot of people say, it don't matter what color Jesus is, right? Go to uh, the 14. Is it 14? 13. Let me start again. Go to 14, it's real quick. This is going to give you the depiction of Jesus, what he really looked like. That one is real name anyway. That's a Greek name. Go ahead. Right. Where did Christian 14. go? Yeah. Okay. Oh, the, the word of the Lord comes. Yeah. Go ahead. His head and his hairs were white like wool. Where's the picture? His head and his hair were white like wool. There's a lot of white people that say, no, this whole face was just white. The white people ain't white anyway. Like your shirt, that's white. Nobody looks like that. All right, go ahead. Real quick. As white as 
snow. Oh, yeah. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. They were red. He drank, he drank wine. Oh, yeah. And his feet like a fine grass. What does fine grass look like? Like a brownish color, right? Yeah. Keep going. Like your complexion. Keep going. As if they were burnt in a furnace. His complexion. You take this white right here, you put it in the furnace, burned past tense. Will be very dark. Yeah, Even cool. in Russia, they yeah. got the real image. Yep. Okay. America is the only <laughs> dumb ones that we don't. Yeah. Our people only ones don't know. Yep. Well, now y'all yeah. know. Yep. Oh, yeah. We here every Saturday. Every right? Saturday. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 All right, man. All right. All right. And people say we don't care about our people. Right. Right. That's what yeah. everybody say. You teach y'all teach hate. You know. It was in the spirit. It was in the spirit that you said, "Hey, man, I'm to my son." You know, well, but now, now they hear it because yeah. again, <laughs> because again, you know, our job, our job is to uh, reach the the whole, the elect, which means what? The elect is going to be scattered among our people, right? We just seen like 200, 200 300 thousand niggas walk by here uh, uh, today, right? And two came came up, man. That means. Why do y'all bust me outside? Why do y'all bust me outside? You don't care if it's just one person, man. Yeah. You know? That wakes up and get it. We ain't out here to reach the multitude. We only here for the elect. Right. 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 Yeah, the elect is very few. Yeah, because you got what you call a wicked multitude as well. Right. Go back to Genesis, the 32nd chapter, there's a wicked multitude, man. Right. Even if it is nobody, we prophesy to the wind. That's why we it's ain't angels. Exactly. Because we ain't yeah. out here. We ain't out here for all these. Views, you know, because when we, when we look at when we look at people that got views, and some, you know, some brothers, you know, do got do got the views because they've been pushing, you know. It's where the but it's where, it's where the spirit go. It really, no matter how long you've been, it kind of does. But it's wherever the spirit go, you know. But a lot of them views, the ones that be doing it out of vain glory, to, and, the, and the guys that be doing it for views, you know what? You know, it be you see the responses that come. Yeah, it's the like. Content. Like if we was cursing out the cop, cops get put on blast. I would be having views, yeah, man. Yeah. Oh, and, and that devil out. It's easy, man. <laughs> if I can say this regarding views, all this place, this, where you want your prize at, man? All this stuff is going to be done away with. You know, yeah, in the kingdom, we ain't going to be, we ain't going to be looking at brothers like, yo, you had a hundred thousand views per video, huh? Yeah. <laughs> like, come on, we don't care about that, man. Right. <laughs> you know, we ain't everything out. is going to be done. We ain't out here for the numbers. And that goes to the, in the story of Joshua, man. You know, and, and Joshua, you know, he took down what? About 30, 30, about 30, 30 kings. With a matter of how many men? A couple hundred thousand or so. You know? You talk about 30 big ass armies, man. But but who did Joshua have? Who did Joshua and the men have on that side? Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. That's faith. That goes into is about faith. Quality, not quantity. Quality. Old Testament that said, uh, "Faith is not uh, stability." Yeah. That time. Uh, we, we can get that. Isaiah thirty-three and thirty-three, 30, 33 and six. Uh, yeah, we can get that real quick. I, I don't know if I want to close up the door. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I have anything else. So we close up on this. On this one. Uh, it's Isaiah. 33 and 6. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy time. It, 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 it didn't say, were you going to say? No, I was, no, go ahead. No, it, it, it said wisdom and knowledge. It didn't say guns and blunts, <laughs> guns and money. You know which money is to <laughs> fix, right? But the wisdom and the knowledge is this is truth. Yeah, that's, that's the real money. Well, the uh, foundation. Biggest flying, uh, big ass arrow walking with a damn uh, blunt in their mouth, a big ass bomber plane. And that, I was going to say that that, that precepts to um, Psalms one ten, you know, because scripture says that um, in the day of thy wrath, but in the day of thy power, thy people shall be willing, you know, because a lot of people they're going to be willing to try to accept the Lord when He starts showing His real power. Power. It's going to be too late, okay? But then it's though that we are already. Uh, in this thing, we, you know, got some roots up in this truth, you know? So we're going to be able to endure a little bit more because we already know how it feels to have, you know, the persecution and all that stuff already, you know? Okay. 
gauge right on the, on the spirit. So there's a faith and stability, something that, something, uh, the, uh, you already know this. Uh, stability of that time. Yeah, stability of that times, man. Faith, wisdom, and, and knowledge, something the stability of that times, man. A lot of people gonna lose their marbles, man. Oh, man, they already started, and the real yeah. shit ain't even hit yet. <laughs> you know? This stuff, this stuff you're seeing around, this stuff you're seeing around, you know, right now, this, this ain't not, I mean, it's something. Because this prophecy popping off left and right. So it's definitely something. I mean, I ain't going to say, you know, it ain't nothing. But it ain't nothing compared to what's up. Uh, to current. Yeah. <laughs> currently. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, you, you good. What was that vision that the uh, elder had? Um, he said that it was missiles coming out anywhere out of the ground that yeah. you won't even expect it. And if you heard men and women scream in the same way, yeah. more like us men screaming like women. All with fear. Yep, we won't have that, man. So yeah, man, a little willing, you know, we edify, you know, the sheep, the sheets of Lord Yahweh and Sinel Shah. You know, uh, 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 you know, we want to end this by giving all praises Honor and glory to Yahweh. Yahweh, 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 Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And a sincere shalom to the Akim that's out there pushing the sincerity and the truth. And it sounds not shalom. I'm a wall flop a ball. Shalom. I'm a wall flop a ball.